Hey beauties, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today I'm at Mary Scott Skincare. This is her new location in Sherman Oaks. If you have followed my skincare journey, you know that I had really bad acne and she was the reason that my skin is now beautifully clear. But today we're not just gonna be talking about the skin on my face, but the skin on my belly, the little stubborn belly fat postpartum, it's not that fun. So we're gonna do something called cryotherapy today. I posted on Instagram, you guys had a bunch of questions, so Mary's gonna answer those questions. I'm gonna show you exactly how it's done. Let's get started. Hi, I'm Mary Scott at Mary Scott Skincare in Sherman Oaks, California. And I'm here with Bianca, one of my faves today. <laughs> and we're gonna do cryotherapy for the fourth time. But I do wanna show you my little before and after. This is, like she said, my fourth time doing it. So here's before treatment one. You can see that I have a little bit of sagging skin, stretched skin from having a baby. Totally normal, but I want it gone. This is, this is where we're at right now. Um, I definitely noticed the difference. I had a lot of sagging skin. But I will say, I am also eating healthy and I'm working out every day. So we're gonna talk about how all those things really play into it. But what I'm hoping for is I have like some excess stretchy skin <laughs> so I'm looking for firmness tightness um, and then just like any little little extra belly fat postpartum or just from eating a lot of uh, sweets <laughs> it definitely helps bloat and Bloating. you want to at least do once a week eight times it's mm -hmm. kind of like working out if you think one workout is gonna help it's not gonna cut it yeah it's just something you have to do and you'll notice results over time mm -hmm. and she'll start continually getting results after this treatment and then we'll see her next week for a follow-up there you go Yay. let's get started so I'm cleansing her skin and prepping it for the cryo session and I like to always wash it towards the lymphatic drainage because cryo is a lot to do with lymphatic drainage and freezing the fat and having it uh, disperse through the liver and kind of when you go potty, when you go, mm -hmm. it, it, it's how all the fat kind of comes out. So cryotherapy, is, is it for skin tightening or more for fat burning? It's both. It's okay. for skin tightening and body firming and it helps, because it's so cold, it helps uh, basically frees the fat mm -hmm. and it kind of uh, it goes through your lymphatic system and your and it drains through your liver and that's how it works yeah and it doesn't hurt too much does it, it doesn't hurt at all it's just mm. really cold <laughs> really cold and it starts to become very numb so I'm gonna read some questions you guys had on Instagram because you had a lot and I don't know the answers to them so Mary um, are there any negative side effects to having this done um, I guess the only negative part is after the treatment, you might have some bloating. It's a little uh, red. And it's red. Just immediately after. Immediately after. And it could last a couple of hours, but that's the only side effect. Mm -hmm. And you have to go to the bathroom a lot <laughs> and drink a lot of water. And I do promote exercising after and, well, and not having carbs. That might be a negative mm -hmm. before. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Does this help with loose skin after having babies? Um, yes. And how many sessions are recommended? I recommend at least six to ten, depending on how much you need. How much you need. Mm -hmm. you're, you're skinny mini, but you <laughs> do have loose skin and it does help that. Okay. Someone wanted to know how soon after having a baby could they do this? You just have to clear it with your doctor. I always say six to eight weeks, mm -hmm. um, but if you have any doubts about that, just clear it with your doctor. And this is a gel that I'm gonna use while I'm using the cryo machine. It's a peptide collagen gel. So it's a little cool, but she's gonna have to get used Ooh. to it. <laughs> Are you okay? So this allows me to use the cryo head so it, it glides smoothly. And when will people start seeing results? You see it after one or I only after feel, a couple? Uh, no, I, th I feel like you, you can see results after one, mm -hmm. but I definitely, one's not gonna be enough. Yeah. Maybe four to six, you'll see, you start seeing really see results. And you also the say that this doesn't replace working out. It doesn't replace working out. Yeah. It doesn't replace working out, it doesn't replace healthy eating, mm -hmm. healthy lifestyle. It's like a booster. A booster. Yeah. Exactly. It's like an immunity booster, but a tummy booster. Yeah. <laughs> Someone said on a scale of chilly to mid-January in Minnesota, how cold is this? <laughs> I think Minnesota initially, and then it's you start to get used to it. Yeah, you definitely get used to it. It's not that bad. 
but I'm going to do the cold intensity, uh, the intensity strong because you've done a few treatments, mm -hmm. so you, you're used to it. And it's begun. And it's begun. So it's kind of like when you told me to ice my face, but it's like icing my tummy with an extreme icer. With an extreme <laughs> glacierizer. Yes. <laughs> I love this machine. And I also do uh, face rejuvenation treatments as well. This also does slimming around the your chin line, jaw mm. line. Someone asked about inner thighs. Inner thighs, okay. arms, booty for lifting cellulite. And how long do you do this? Do I do this yeah. for an, uh, 30 minutes? 30 minutes. Yes. And does it get yeah. colder or does it just stay at this level? It can get, yes, it does get colder, but I need to go slow initially mm -hmm. to get it down very low temperature. Mm -hmm. And when it gets down low, then I can kind of move it around a little bit more because I need to get this whole area. I need to get it below a certain Celsius to be able to freeze the fat. What Celsius are we at? We are at 15. So I want to get minus. Negative See how it's going to degrees. Negative <laughs> degrees. So it's getting lower and lower. And if I move it over to a different part of her tummy, it's going to get a little warmer again. Does it get rid of your stretched skin or tummy wrinkles from giving birth? So this does not uh, help stretch marks, but it does tighten skin. We do offer a treatment that does that we do help stretch marks that will uh, definitely improve on stretch marks. Stretch marks or they call it, uh, it's called stria. Stria is the true name for uh, scarring or stretch marks, excuse mm -hmm. me. And we do have a machine that helps stria stretch marks. So something, is that for skin or fat, so both? Right. Yeah, so it's skin tightening and fat freezing. So Bianca said she had three more questions. One was, is this better than lipo? I don't think anything's better than lipo. <laughs> <laughs> lipo is legitimately going, you're going to notice a difference right away. It's like but a surgery though, It's right? a surgery. And they're this is removing fat. They're removing fat and it's, it, it, you're bruised for quite some time, yeah. but it works. There's nothing like a tummy tuck as well, like a mommy makeover, you mm -hmm. know. So those work very, very well. Um, this is something that is, you know, done. It, there's way less invasive. Way <laughs> less invasive. Um, they cost a hundred dollars a treatment and I'm going to give a summertime special of 20% off. Ooh, just for Ooh. my subscribers, my girlfriends. <laughs> <laughs> um, and she also asked if this is better than cool sculpting. Cool sculpting is a bit different because it's a medical, um, procedure, medical grade procedure. And it is something that is left on the body for, uh, over a long period of time. I feel like this treatment, it, it, it works in a way the same and there's a lot more um, flexibility where I'm actually utilizing the, the hand piece so I have more control. Um, and there's gonna be less bruising, also again, less downtime mm. with this versus the, the, the cool sculpting. If cool sculpting isn't like a same. No, thing. cool sculpting is a medical device that they actually use. I think they have to use these certain clip ons or so something that stays on you. Stays on you, oh, okay. and you're sitting there for an hour, oh. freezing. Oh, okay. Yeah, different. A lot more bruising, a mm -hmm. lot more edema, swelling, things mm -hmm. like that. And that, again, that's also a medical grade device. This is not a medical grade device. So is it like really cold right now? It's very cold. I can't really feel my tummy anymore. It's like numb. It's numb, numb. But it doesn't hurt. Okay. Can I touch it? You can touch it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoa. Whoa, that's crazy. Cold. That's, wow. As I said, I would say cold. 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 <laughs> cold. Now I'm taking the gel off. And I'm going to apply this elastin transform body treatment it's amazing it's it goes really well with any treatments that you're doing laser treatments cryo treatments um it's great for firming okay. and elasticity so you only need two pumps morning and night and i'll give you a 10 percent discount on this and it's available online or in store cool. on your website or on, on my website, website. okay perfect. yeah on my website
I'm also going to apply a little bit of coconut oil. Is it just for the body? For That's the just for the body, yes. I also have other serums for the face by Elastin that are really amazing. Go ahead and take a nice deep breath in. And this is a nice peppermint breathe essential oil, just nice to finish her treatment off. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we did a little light peel on her today too. I'm <laughs> spanning my burning <laughs> face. <laughs> so this is how I look immediately after. Little red, little bloating. Let it all go down and tighten as it does. So that is everything that I think you need to know about cryotherapy. If you have any questions, leave a comment down below, but also follow Mary Scott Skincare on Instagram. You can DM her or email her and get more answers about any questions you may have about cryotherapy or your acne skin or whatever you're going through with your skincare. I personally have been coming to see Mary once a month, but if you do book cryotherapy, it's better to even do it once a week. So I might try to get in here even more often and see even more drastic changes, but you're also gonna see the most results if you're eating healthy and also exercise. So this is not a replacement, unfortunately. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe, I post new videos every week. You also can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter at Ms. Bianca Renee. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching Bianca Renee today.